Hey everyone out there on the interwebs and the YouTubes. Uh, I am Drew with Comics Late, and once again, I'm here with Kyle, not Kevin. Please get it right. Come on, it's been a few months now. Uh, so uh, this is going to be a solicitation video. I'm going to try to speed things up along this time because they always they always didn't drag long. Uh, yeah, a little long in the tooth. Long, yes, they are. Yeah. yeah. Um, so we've narrowed it down. We're just going to do uh, Marvel, DC, and Image. And uh, we're gonna try to go through them faster, but if something doesn't look interesting, it's like blah, blah, pass. And then we'll make our comments on what does. And uh, so, with that being said, we're going to go ahead and get started. Here we go. Let's get to bring it up. Here we go. That's StreamYard. Losers. Yep. Here we go. Marvel Comics. Full solicitations, October 2021. We are at Bleeding Stool. Yay. And uh, all I gotta say is, when you're on bleeding stool, make sure your uh, computer has had its uh, shots and uh, penicillin shots, you know, because you never know what you're gonna walk oh, away with. Yeah, could be nasty. Indeed. All right, here we go. Starting off, Venom number one. Another one. Yep, another number one. <laughs> Al Ewing and Ram V and Brian Hitch on the art, art and cover. Yep. So Bill Hitch is officially back at Marvel now. Yay. Brian Hitch. Brian right. Hitch. Brian Hitch. Yeah. The. So, hot off Venom 200, Extreme Carnage. We're closing out 2021 with one of the, with, uh, one of the most ambitious books in Soviet history. All new oh. Venom from scrap from some of comics' greatest talents. Marvel mainstay Al Ewing, who himself has endured a character running, fighting run on the Mortal Hulk, being joined by Ram V, or Maestro on his own. I do sure. trust Ram V. I like Ram V. Yep. Craft a mind bending and gut wrenching tale of symbiosis, the likes of which Marvel Universe has never seen. So, if that wasn't enough, Joined by Brian Hitch, who is leaving it all on the page. Okay. okay. All right. I don't care for the That's bowl. Awful. Is that is that a is that a bowl? Cow? That's what it looks like. Looks like a cow. But the, that, that cover by that Brian Hitch. Cool. Yeah, that does not say venom. No, that does here to the left. Dumb. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's I like that. Yeah, once again, it looks like a five year old drew this. Oh yeah, what am I talking about? It's Peach Momoko. Oh. <laughs> I owe. Uh, so, yep, yeah, I'll check it out. There, There's a preview of it in the um, Spider-Man Venom for Comic Book Day comic coming up, which I already read. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's a take. Okay. I'll say that. It's a take. Yeah. I like takes. Yeah. <laughs> and here we go. Amazing Spider-Man. This is, like, running almost weekly in October, which is wow. crazy. I, first off, these covers, they look amazing. Most of them look amazing. They do. This one by Joe Jesco. This is like the month of Joe Jesco. He's got several covers this month. Jeez. That is haunting. It is. I love it. Demi Goblin. Love it. That's, uh, yeah. And that Demi, yeah, that Demi, 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 yeah, it's Demi, Demi, it's Demi, Demi, Demi Goblin. Okay. Well, it's like, yeah, because sure Demi Goblin was hot. That's true. Yeah, so I am all on board. If there's a story yeah. sitting around him, I'd be all about sure. that. Yeah. Good. So Zeb Wells writing, Patrick Gleason in the, in the art, and Beyond Board, Kelly Thompson, Sally Knock, uh, uh, Cody Ziegler, sure. Patrick, Gle Patrick Gleason, the artist is writing, and okay. Zeb Wells, uh, yeah, so. Could be good. Could uh, be bad. Yeah. And you got the other variants down here. It's, yeah, for uh, 76, right after that, because what they're alluding to is that Peter is going to die. Does this mean Peter? Yeah, we're bringing up the death of Peter Parker, and Ben Riley is going to be taking over as Peter Parker as a Spider Man. Okay, so, yep, we're led to believe that this is the consequence of the undoing mm -hmm. of uh, One More Day, the undoing. Yet that, okay, yeah, that Peter's going to have to pay the pay the piper. Time to pay the fiddler. Yep, <laughs> time to pay the fiddler, whore. <laughs> yeah. Oh That's man, cool. that Joe Jesco, man, God, he does not get enough work. Love it, awesome. Yes. So yeah, the unthinkable has happened. Then will Patrick Gleason remind you why you love and hate comics? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, that, okay. So it's not okay. Okay, so it's apparently it's not um, the current Nick Spencer killing Spider Man. It's these it's these numbskulls. Oh, okay. These numbskulls are killing Peter. Okay. Oh good. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Along with Kelly Thompson. Yeah, Kelly Thompson, you get no uh, reprieve from us. Yeah. God, these that, old scores. Yeah, so awesome. yeah, perfect. Love it. Captures that mm -hmm. 60s awesomeness. Yes, it does. So, Kelly Thompson and Sarah Pacelli pick up the baton to define the new era. Of oh, 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 no. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Beyond Corp the Beyond Corporation has returned, and this is your chance to meet the people who've who brought you the new and improved Spider-Man. Oh. 
Yes. <laughs> All right. We'll see what happens. It's about time we had a new Spider-Man. Yes, it's about we, time. We haven't <laughs> had any new Spider-Men. No, there have been none. No, no there's been, 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 been a spiderless void. It's only been kind the, of yeah. annoying. Yes, yeah. it is. Yeah. So thank God. It's about time. It is. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. <laughs> oh, man. Wow. Like I said, this is a month of Joe Jesco. Holy crap. That is fantastic. Too bad it's Immortal Hulk, but yes. awesome cover nonetheless. Yeah. So far, noticing the thing with his covers, his covers specifically, a lot of stuff probably won't even ha end up happening in the comics. Correct. Which is a shame. Yes, it is. So Al Ewing, look, he's, yep, he's finishing up his run on Immortal Hulk. Has it been, is this the final? It's been over two, three years now? Like three oh, years. Yeah. yeah, three years for 50 issues. God. So 12, 24, 36, 40, no. That's not bad. It's not bad. No, it's not. For, yeah. Yeah. Uh, down the below place, the Hulk searches among the ghosts of the past for the answers to all his questions. One below all, the Green Door, Samuel Stearns, Jackie McGee, and Bruce Banner. All been leading to this. All, all, all been leading here to Jack McGee. The return oh. of Jack McGee. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. It's about time. Yep. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be there to check it out, see how it ends. If it lands flat on its face, we'll find out. I stopped like yeah. issue like 12, yeah. <laughs> 18. Maybe. I can't fault you for that. Yeah. Dark Ages, number two of six. Issue one sounded amazing. Yeah. And here's the main cover to issue one. Looks cool. good. Yep. That is uh, the Stegman. Yep. Stegman cover. Looks good. That looks like uh, the first issue of Hush, kind of. Kind of. Yeah, it's making mm -hmm. the same kind of. Yeah, that pose. Yes. That pose, yeah. Well, actually, we'll take a close look at that next time. Yeah. Dark, yeah, so this is the variant. We got Apocalypse. Ooh, cool. Awesome Apocalypse. But I'm kind of bewildered up what here. What the hell is that? Yeah. It's like, it looks like Miles, but with the symbiote. Symbiote. Symbiote Spooge. Okay. And uh, not Wolverine. No, not, not Wolverine. We got Sue. We had, Sue Storm. Okay, Sue Storm. Thankfully, her, head, her head's not half shaved, that's, so that's good. Yeah, yeah. And we got Little, little Parker. Okay. Baby or is it? Yeah. Uh, um, and it's got orange. It's got. Orin, it's got is it ginger? So I, I think Harry's? it's. Is it no? And well, ooh, it could be Harry's. Yeah, yeah. Or Flash's. So or is, is, is it Flash Thompson right now? Is yeah, it? yeah, yeah. I think yeah. so. Yeah. So many iterations. But, and then you got a Hulkbuster. A Hulkbuster armor, Iron Man. But I thought technology stopped working. But hey, he found a way. Yeah. Like, it's Tony Stark. Uh, uh, yeah. Finds a way. way. It's been years. Oh, it's been years since uh, the age of technology ended in a single moment. Like a switch has been flickered off. Okay, now our heroes attempt to bring humanity together in a darkness. Okay. X Men, Avengers, Vigilantes, and Villains all work together to create something better, something darker than the night is descending on the world. Our post apocalyptic world is about to face apocalypse. Ooh. Apocalypse. Okay. I dig so it. So now is when you strike. Yes, exactly. Smart. Yes. Return uh, the, oh the death of Doctor Strange Avengers number one. Thank you for killing off every white male yes. so far, Marvel. It's about time. <laughs> yeah. It's about time. Finally, <laughs> the death of every white male. <laughs> well, finally, <laughs> with Doctor Strange gone, the Avengers are the only ones who can stop a rampaging Juggernaut like oh, monster from oh, wrecking oh. all of Manhattan. Juggernaut like monsters, not Juggernaut, but Juggernaut like monster. A taller Juggernaut. What does this mystical creature want? Find out. Well, I'll check it out. Kill all males. Yeah. <laughs> it's about time. Yep. Strange Academy presents now. Death of Dr. Strange. Oh, my. Yeah, that is awesome. That is awesome. Yes. Love it. Mm. Perfect. That's my Dr. Strange. Yes, it is. Yeah. Ooh, Baron Mordo. This one isn't bad. But Dan Panosian. You got, a, you got a pro. Yeah. 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 It's got a Mike Diodato style to it. it does, it's yeah. like Mike Diodato slash Klaus Jansen look to it. Yeah. I dig it. Yeah, yeah. Life's a whole dig it. Yeah. So with the Sorcerer Supreme gone, so to our Earth's mystical, magical defenses, now the rest of Earth's heroes have their hands full with multiple invasions from all other dimensions. Interesting. Meet the three mothers. Hmm. Ooh. Those mother... Yeah. <laughs> you mothers. Mothers. <laughs> Ooh, Inferno number two. <sighs> that, you cannot do this anymore. I, I'm just waiting. I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for the Twitter... Half head, sh half head shaped psychos to go after this cover to have it canceled. I'm waiting yep. for it. It's going to happen. I mm. love this cover. That is damn beautiful. It is Inferno. Yes. Sexual and violent. Yep. 
That even that Magneto's pretty cool, even though it's all looks like three D modeled. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, it really does. Yeah, it looks like the the vigilante whatever what was that cover. It was like it reminds me of the the dead shot one that uh, was done with the balls oh, fraining yeah. down. Uh, let's see here, secrets lies. They have a way of coming out and biting you when you least expect them. Secrets and lies of Krakow sure. will shake it to it to its foundation. Oh Jonathan, Hick oh, Jonathan Hickman's coming back to the party. How about that? The Hick. Yeah, the Hick. So, yeah, I'll check it. If your one was good, we'll check it out. Yeah. Black Panther Legends. No. Yes. Oh. So this story right here, Darkhold Blade. Okay. So let's uh, look even closely here. Oh, looking. Yep. That looks cool. That's awesome. Yep. Darkhold Blade. So this is Darkhold is another miniseries going on this fall. Um, apparently, are you fanged or are you the food? The world is divided into humans and vampires, and Blade, the one who walks between them both and kills with equal impunity. So after reading from the cursed Darkhold, Blade and a cadre of other heroes were met were meant to enter uh dimension <laughs> and stop the ancient god from destroying the multiverse. But reading the book has changed all their lives and histories, and for Blade, the consequences are far reaching. Vampires rule the world and he rules over them all. So they read from a book they shouldn't have read from, and if so facto, Blade rules the vampires. It's like Evil Dead. Yeah. So by reading this, this sounds amazing. Then I discover who's writing it. Daniel oh, Kimble Smith. Smith. Yep. Oh no. It, it was yeah. Oh no. <laughs> it's so funny when you read the the, the news have, the news break about this, like the story coming out. It's they bury the lead of who's writing it down to the very bottom. I wonder why? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> so, but I want to check it because that is a that is an awesome headline. I am enticed by it, but this is coming from the guy who was terrified of Night Thrasher. So, true. We'll see what happens. Now he does with Blade. Yeah. So Darkhold, this is the miniseries it's all tying into. Darkhold, Iron Man. Th this looks, this is something out of Akira, it looks like. Yeah, it really is. Body dysmorphia. Morphia and that's, technology Jesus. and, yeah. That's disgusting. Yes, it is. But I kind of like it. Likewise. <laughs> and uh, Ryan North. Oh, oh, all right. Turns his talents to, quote unquote, talents yeah. to a brand new genre. Called forth to face the dread god. <laughs> <laughs> Iron Man needs to. I'm reading an ancient, ill-fated text to Darkhold. Text to Darkhold and it changes the course. So everyone changes. Every everyone reads it and it changes the past. Okay. Everyone reads yeah. the Necronomicon kind of, yeah. and it does bad things to you. <laughs> <laughs> Get back to you. To you. <laughs> and we got another Joe Jesco cover here from Marvel Voices, Voices, which is, which is okay. That's probably gonna be the best thing about this damn comic. The, That's that cool cover. cover. Yeah. White Ranger. I like yep, it. Yep, the White Ranger. Luke Cage, City of Fire. Um, <sighs> did you re hear about this? Yes, I did. Yes. I written know. by Ho Chi Anderson, whose parents named him after Ho, <laughs> Ho Chi Minh Man. and uh, Che Guevara. It's like, yeah. you're not helping yourself. You're not doing yourself any favors. Do you know so. history? Yeah. Your the parents, answer is no. No. Yeah. His parents, his parents are idiots. Yeah, yeah. Look, up, uh, look up Che Guevara. Vera, yeah, exactly. Yes. Yeah. God, this comic. I was watching Thinking Critical, actually. This is when I first heard about this. And, uh, yeah, no. This uh, isn't meant for us. It's like, there's no escapism. Reading a comic like this, there is no escapism. Nope. At all. I mean, can you imagine if they had done something like this back in, like, 1991 after the Rodney King incident, you know? Yeah. I, no, every editor, no. editor would have been like, no. No, don't touch this. Do not touch this at all. No. Yeah. Yeah. First off, it requires no talent. Yeah. Whatsoever. Yes. You're literally ripping it from headlines. Yeah, I wonder how much I wonder how much of the dialogue is gonna be written you know, taken from all that stuff. Yeah. Um, there were people watching CNN and MSNBC way too much, and they're like, oh, yeah. this is perfect. Yeah. For a story. Case in point, Ho Chi Anderson. Yeah. But it's like I like Luke Cage. Yeah, me too. Yeah. He's a fun character. Yeah. I like to see him and he does help out with New York and he like mm -hmm. he's really it's like this is a great story but when you literally bring in BLM yeah and riots mm -hmm. um that I mean right there in the first sentence it's like it's like that's what you're telling me right there it's like, yeah really yeah a, a cadre of crooked cops uh-huh yeah. shocking I wonder where you got that from, from yeah <laughs> <laughs> Kazar, Lord of the Savage Land, number two of five. Zach Thompson, German Garcia. Change uh, has come to Savage Land. Kazar and Shana can feel it as the Plunder family travels in hopes of protecting their lands from a mysterious illness that plagues the forest. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe. Typhoid? 
Could be. Okay. King and the Conqueror, number three of five, written by two guys I've never heard of before in my life. Uh, yeah. Young King stalks his future self to the side of the first major battle of the Avengers, hoping to change the course of his destiny. And no one interferes with Victor Von Doom timeline. Victor Von Doom. Oh, look, Kang versus Kang versus Doom. I'm too tired. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm still waiting to see how good the first issue is going to be before I invest in that. Kang's cool. Yeah. But, mm -hmm. yeah. Black Panther number three. This is uh, a lie. This is issue one got pushed back to November. Oh. I saw. Yeah. So this is not coming out in uh, for a while. October. Yeah. Not for a while. Yeah. It's a shame. So I'm sure he, he was probably doing the same storyline as the Ho Chi Minh's uh, story. Like, a, like and, hey, you're doing the yeah. same. Hey, you you watch yeah. CNN too? Yeah. Bro! Bro, whoa, what are the bro. odds? What are the odds? Wait, you're talking about a black guy too? Hey, hey. we're both are. Okay. Miss Marvel, no. Absolutely not. Dark Hawk number three of five. It all depends on how good issue one is. Maybe. Kyle Higgins. Could he's good, he's, he's writing uh, his own ticket to Power Rangers right now. And... Uh, from what I've heard, it's no bueno. Yeah, yeah it fell off the cliff. Is, if you like the Power Rangers, you'll like it. Yeah, I like Power Rangers. So maybe, Amazing Fantasy. Yeah. I read issue. I read. I, I read issue one. It was a lot of fun. Yes, it, it is. is. Yeah, it's a lot of fun, and these covers are damn that good. And that's awesome. Is that Storm? That's Storm on a horse. Yeah. On a horsey. You were on a horsey. You were on a horsey. <laughs> oh, I just, Spidey's mask, uh, Black Widow's gauntlets, cap shield. Hmm. Yes. It's about time. Yes, it is. Even <laughs> Finally. <in fantasy. laughs> Mark Bagley. That's yeah. a cool cover. Love it. Like. Yeah. Although she looks a little too old. Yeah. You know, Carrie Andrews drew her. She's she looked pretty kid. young. Yeah. She, she looks very kid. kitty. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's like, I guess maybe they're just they okay. let them do. As in, wait, uh, not Wolverine. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, it, it is the Wolverine. This is okay. The I wasn't sure yeah. what he's called anymore. Yeah, as, uh, mm -hmm. you can't have two Wolverines. Yeah. <laughs> this is War. Spider-Man, World War II, Captain America, Spy School, Black Widow fight to survive the amazing, their amazing fantasy. So I guess they're not going to be involved in, at all. It's just a cool okay. cover. Okay. Sure. Sure. Okay. Good. I'm I'm there. Why not? Deadpool. No. I'm Come I'm over. I'm still I'm still burnt out in Deadpool. <laughs> yeah, he needs to go away for a while. Ooh, Moon Knight wow. number four. Hope I'm still reading it. That's Steve McNevin? Holy crap. Damn. He is changing up his style for every cover. Yeah, I he swear is. he is. Yeah, he is. That, that is fantastic. Doesn't even look like McNevin. No, not at all. Love it. Yeah. Uh let's see here. Cover variant cover, Stormbreakers variant. So we got three covers for that one. Not 17. Not okay. 17, yep. Night, night in the Life, from Walking Till Midnight to Moon Knight's Life is filled with peril and mysterious foe attacks from a new and unexpected direction. An old foe comes to visit, and Moon Knight finds himself answering the same question over and over again. Why do you wear the mask? Hmm. Featuring a guest appearance from the Striped Sensation Tigra. Okay, so she is in the book. Awesome. Oh, hey, that helps. Yeah, <laughs> love it. Okay. Eternals Forever. No. no. Eternals Celestia, they, they, yeah, they... um. No. Sex change to the characters and they're of course trying to tie it into ten the one million BC Avengers. It's like there's nothing you can do to make the in Eternals interesting. You yeah. guys have had sixty years to make them interesting. Yeah. Does not work. It's a fun concept and yeah. theory, but when you actually think about it, it's like, why does anybody care about you guys? Yes. Exactly. Like, why do you care about yeah. anything? And hence, why should I care? <laughs> That's why I don't. And you're going to bring in a million yeah. BC. Speaking of stuff I should care about, X Men yes. Legends, number eight. Omega Red. Oh, love awesome. it. That is an awesome cover. Wow. Love it. Yes. You see how big Omega Red is. Mm -hmm. I, I love it. Uh, Billy Tan, art and cover. Scott Williams on a variant cover. Uh oh. Yes. Oh, yes. Wolverine's hunt for the missing mutants goes from bad to worse. Following G Lady Deathstrike and the mysterious Jai Jai to Shanghai. That's a mouthful. Yeah. Where Hino, Chan, and Jubilee have been taken, Logan will have to keep Yuri safe while dealing with the hand. But who invited Omega Red to the battle? Mega, Mega Red versus Wolverine in an all-new tale. It's one of their, making one of this one of their earliest bouts in continuity. Bet you, bet you weren't counting on that. No, I wasn't. So, yeah, I'm okay. there. Yeah. Sure. Good. Trial of Magneto, number three of five. That looks like Joe. Is that Joe Jessica? That looks like Joe. Yep. Yep, it is. That is Joe. Yeah. 
That's beautiful. It's cool. Love it. Just throwing everything at him. Mm-hmm. It. What the hell? what the hell is that? Yeah. What the hell is that? It's like it's Crested the artist, Clown. Artist yeah. It's formerly known as Prince. Prince. Yeah. <laughs> Truth won't stay buried, nor nor will other things. Who lurks in the shadows, and what do they know? It's the shadow. The shadow knows. Was, yeah, the shadow lurks in the shadows, and he's the one who knows. That's 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 a stupid question right there. Are they bringing in the shadow? <gasps> oh, they got the right to the shadow somehow. The shadow is behind there, or is it? Or are they saying the shadow master? Oh. Shadow King, Shadow King, Shadow King. Yeah, Shadow, King. Shadow King. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Eh, maybe. Uh, Ooh, oh, yeah. damn. Joe, you're nailing it this oh. month. Love it. His Marvel Masterwork stuff. That's love hot. it. Man. I love that storm. That's my storm right there. Yes. Mm -hmm. So I guess that all ties in with that. Oh, that's for Sword? Oh, S-Word. 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 Number, number nine. Abigail Brand's attention divided between two sword, sta sword stations. All Orcus needs is to pick their moment to strike. Sharp as Alexandra is making her first formal visit to the Lake Hella's diplomatic ring. Eh. Okay, I've already lost interest yeah, after right. the second you sentence. You lost me after sword. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hellions. Oh, God. Joe, man. These Holy crap. Wow. Love it. Mm. I love how we're all fawning over the covers. The, the, the stories just <laughs> suck ass. Is garbage. <laughs> the wheels have come off the Hellions bandwagon. You got that right. Yeah, they <laughs> might all hate one another, but Nanny loves her latest edition. Nah. Uh, I just, nah, I don't. Maybe. Oh, Joe! <laughs> Holy crap, man! Damn, I remember having that card. I yep. love that card. Yes. Man. God, that is Cyclops That's right there. Cyclops. Yes. It's about time. It is. <laughs> Finally. I'm not dunks on Cyclops. I like Cyclops. I've always liked Cyclops. Likewise. It's Halloween and the X-Men have oh, faced the face of horror <laughs> born in a neighborhood town in Westchester. The Headless Horse. Oh. oh. I'll give them this. That's awesome. That is a cool cover. Uh, is that Cyclops? That's Cyclops' head? That's Cyclops' that, head. That is, uh, yeah. oh, or is it? It is. Yeah, that's Maybe. a visor. That does. Is Cyclops the headless horseman? The horseless headsman? Man. Oh. Headless horseman? I, I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll check it out begrudgingly. I, yes. Yeah, begrudgingly. X Force. Is that jo another Joe? Oh, man. Yeah. Joe. Damn. Man. Love it. Stop being so good. I know, right? You need to give someone else a chance. All yeah. right. You're being too good. Step aside. Side. Yeah. Hashtag time's up. <laughs> Mikhail Rasputin's nest, nesting of doll agents have infiltrated Krakoa before, but never like this. If Black Tom can't root out their invasion of beasts, the consequences go beyond mere death. Time for Pietro Rasputin, aka Colossus, to step down. Yeah. Uh, maybe. 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 He moves. Hey, there he is. Shadow King. Like and that. these covers kind of suck. Yeah, suck. <laughs> He's been skirting the lines, silking around the wild hunt. Now he's simply gone too far in Krakoa, where the dead walk among the living and the unforgivable have been forgiven. The new mutants now battle an old foe, the psychic and then you know that's Shadow King. Yeah, sorry, yeah, you yeah. can't give me a cure for the new mutants. They, they suck ass. I'm sorry. They did all die. Do Joe! Holy. God. Yes! Mm. Yes! Man. Damn. Damn. Now, it, it reminds me of when a couple years ago when Marvel was doing the Jim Lee variants. Mm -hmm. And like, those all sold well. Those all sold well. <laughs> you wonder why. These will all sell well. <laughs> yes, they will. Every single one. Yep. Maverick returns to team up with Wolverine. Meanwhile, CIA agent Jeff Bannister has just uncovered a secret surveillance device of aimed at Krakoa. Now, someone wants their bug back and Bannister out of the picture. I mean, he's maybe? Going against Adam Cooper. He's making Adam Cooper look yeah. like a scumbag. Someday. Yeah. Damn. Love it. Well, then again, you know, I'll say this. This is Joe Jesco stuff from like 30 years ago. Right. If it was Adam Cooper stuff from 30 years ago, that'd be tough. That would be tough. That would be very tough. I'd like to see that. Yes. Marauders. Oh, love that Bishop cover. Hell yeah. The, 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 it's a gun. Is it? It's like a pistol shotgun? It's a pistol shotgun. It's a pistol shotgun. Hey, I like it. <laughs> He's from the future. Maybe they found a yes. way. <laughs> <laughs> to, to come compartmentalize because I want a pump action revolver. Mm. Why not? 
<laughs> oh, he's got two from right. He's got oh. a Kitty Pride, which is, that's okay. That's good. It's good. Yeah. So, yeah. I, okay. Yeah. You don't cross Emma Frost, even if she was the one who crossed you first. Murder's trip into space. It's bloody and in space no one can hear you bleed. That sounds terrible. Oh, that is terrible. No. Are you flipping kidding me? Whoever wrote no. that is a moron. Oh, my God. No. The covers look good, though. Yes. Two out of three ain't bad. Yeah. Oh, Captain Britain. Brian Braddock. Love it. Hey, everyone's talking about how Henry Cavill's met mm -hmm. with Marvel, mm -hmm. and he may, he could be an awesome Captain Britain. Yeah. Just saying. The ten kingdoms or other world must decide are Excalibur heroes of the realm or a rich breed to be put to the stake. I, I don't care. I've lost I interest. Yeah. <laughs> Most of the audience has, has, has lost interest too. Two? <laughs> yeah. Marvel's number six. I. Marvels. <laughs> Sean and I forgot about this after issue that's two. True. <laughs> Spider Ooh, Woman. Ooh, that's a cool cover. That's mm -hmm. not. Eternum? A Eternum? Fred and Jets' right. family? Yeah, Jets sure. fighting back with, with her family. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. It's one of the Drew clan. Uh oh, Drew. Uh oh. Whoa. The Drew clan. Whoa. It's getting a little close to home. Yeah. Miles Morales, Spider-Man. No. Hashtag my Spider-Man. Yeah, I wonder what storyline they're gonna rip off now from Spider-Man. Whoops. <laughs> yep. Spider-Man Crossroads. Yes, absolutely. I'll be there. Mm -hmm. Peter David writing it. Yes. Spider-Man and the Incredible Hulk forces with the deviants. Wait, that can't be right, can it? Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah. Maybe go out for yourself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Greg Land in York, yes. Oh, She-Hulk. Is that an actual She-Hulk? That is She-Hulk right there. I'm surprised they're allowed to get away with that. I know, right? God. Hashtag it's about time. Yep. Yeah. Hashtag finally. My She-Hulk. Hashtag my She-Hulk. Hashtag uh, finally. Yeah. Hashtag long hair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hashtag perm. <laughs> yeah. God. Or beneath the waves. Winter Hulk. Win oh. The, the Winter Hulk? Yeah, because she, the um, She-Hulk in transition, it's been in the, the Red Room. Okay. Yeah. The summer me. Yeah. The winter, winter me. <laughs> sent to Atlantis with a dark mission. She's been sent to Atlanta. Atlantis. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah we're gonna Atlantis. Pretend it's actually Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> Things will get even darker and blowier if the Russian super assassin Red Widow has her way. But I matter who the shock. Yeah. This just sounds terrible. I'm yeah, sorry. It sounds dumb. Uh thinking of the song Echo. No. Avengers at uh, Tech on. Tech on and the Avengers. Tech on. Yeah, because it, this is yeah, it's um Jim Zub who wrote the other one. The okay. um, oh Jim McKay wrote the other one. Oh oh so uh -oh. Maybe, I don't know. Loki, Lord of Lies, imbued with the Infinity Shard energy. The Avengers can't trust anything. They see her here. They'll need help from an aspect of source to try and turn the tide. So maybe. Okay. Maybe. Yeah. That first series was cool. So first off, uh Christopher Cantwell can go F himself F himself. He is a terrible uh, comic book writer. His Iron Man run is terrible. Aww. But the Joe Jesco cover is beautiful. That's cool. Yes. I love it. I like that. So if you see the seal spike up, yeah, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's because I can write after all. Yeah. Uh, Captain Marvel. Oh, yeah, because they're bringing back the, the Marvel from the 90s. Captain Marvel from the 90s. Yes. Yep. Ooh, Lady. Is that uh, Deathbird? Looks like her. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. I like. Wonder if she'll actually be in the comic. Doubt it. Yeah. Or at the very end. Marvels are under attack. So yeah, it's all, I guess it's all, all the Marvels. Is, is. All the Marvels is, 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 is. Yeah. Not the Marvels is, is. Yeah. And what the Dark Marvels are up to next with the Target. Yeah, maybe. We'll see what happens. Shang-Chi, no. But it's Shang-Chi. No. It, Iron it, The first few issues sucked. Did they fix? They oh, I think they corrected. Ooh. I think they they did an edit to this. I think Joe Jesco edited this one. I'm fairly certain this image of the thing he had a stogie. I was gonna say, do you have a cigar? In his mouth? I'm fairly certain he had a cigar in his mouth. And uh, I think they probably made Joe fix it. Joe fix it. Yeah. Mr. Fix it. Yeah, I think I think they had him fix it. 
Because no one can smoke anymore. That's that's true. Yeah, that is a, a joke. It's out of mandate. There's no smoking in a Marvel universe. It's about time. Yep. Yeah, no. Hashtag yeah. <laughs> hashtag finally. <laughs> Fallout from the FF 60th anniversary story continues. Spider-Man might help with that. Then Alicia to take their take their kids trick or treating for the very first time. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. Uh, yeah. Winter Guard, another one. Maybe I don't. Ryan, Katie, I have no clue who you are. Covers Maybe. suck. Yeah, both covers do suck. <laughs> absolutely. I'm fairly certain Joe Jesco did an Alpha Flight piece at some point or another. He had to have. Yeah, I hope so. Trails Bound in the Darkest Corner of Russia. Uh, maybe. Yeah. Game of Flight, I've lost slow, I've quickly lost interest in this book. Oh. Issue 2 was a big step down. Maybe 3 will be better. Oh, no. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Black Widow. Oh, yeah. I love the cover. That is I like I, that. Black Widow I grew up with. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, same. She's hot. Yes, she is. And... A badass. Yeah, Black Widow and her team have stumbled into some high stakes cr high society crime. Not, I okay. I've lost interest right there. Of course, it's high society. Champions now. Captain America, definitely now. Christopher Cantwell and go after yourself. Because now we've got a Captain America, Captain America of the military. I'm sure, you heard about that? This is yes. Captain America of the military. Yeah. God. Hashtag about time. Yeah. Hashtag finally. Something like that. God. Thor, yes. Wow. Oh, and Thor. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. I love it. Throg. <laughs> After the events of Revelation, Thor is a top secret mission. The only one trusted ally, ally can carry out. Throg, the Frog of Thunder. <laughs> yes. I will be there for that. Yeah. I guarantee you, this is going to sell out. See? Donny Cates knows what he's doing. Yes. I guarantee you, this is going to get a second or third printing yeah, yep. by this cover alone. Absolutely. Yeah. And it's going to help with the Joe Jesco, too. I want them both. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, love it. But that throg, I, that that is awesome. <laughs> oh, Pasquale uh, Ferries will be doing the art. Nice. Makes a return trip to Asgard for this unique tale of otherworldly espionage, one that will have a profound impact in the future of the Marvel Universe. I yep. am there. I'm there. Yes. Savage Avengers, no. This series has been terrible. It's only gotten worse. Uh, Defenders 3, no. Oh. oh, that is a kingpin. Oh, they got. Oh, hey, he, hey he's, he's got. Thing. Yes, he is, but he's not in his mouth, though. That's true. Is it okay? Yeah, yeah I, I guess. Maybe. Yeah, but I love it. That's cool. It is. Yes. I like. Yep. Uh, so Daredevil 35, Lockdown. Okay, he's locked down already. Oh, uh, well, Bullseye is, is on, on the loose now, and he's gone crazy. So, oh, yeah. So we need uh, not yep. Daredevil to. Stop him. Yep. Need not dare double to stop him. Yep. Okay. Is this going to be another rematch? Is he? Is she going to kill him this time? <laughs> or is he going to kill her again? Or are they going to kill each other? Oh, wait. Ooh. Ooh. They can kill each other because yes. a man can't kill a woman. That so. is true. Yeah, that is true, Kyle. Yeah. That is true. Kill each other. Warhammer. <laughs> no. Don't understand it. Nope. Never cared for it. Yeah. Alien. The, these wow. are some interesting. That, <laughs> <laughs> that is so original. I I kind of like it. I I kind of like that. I like it. Yeah. I don't know why, but I do. And uh, I got this one here. The chickens. Okay. And the, like, so a, a chicken xenomorph? It's coming home to roost. Just, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Xenomorph down on the farm. Farm, yep. This be a new corn thrasher. Yep. Corn, corn thrasher. thrasher. Horn fresher. Xenomorphs <laughs> overtake the settlement. A last stand is made. A terrible truth is learned. Do not have xenomorphs as chickens. Indeed. I don't know. The <laughs> Republic. Nope. It's still a thing, huh? Yeah, it's still a thing, apparently. Nope. Nope. No, this is, this is still going on. <laughs> My God. Five of five. It's last, last Jesus. one. Jesus. No. I. Now. Now. No. No, read Shadows of the Empire, you get a better story, right? Yeah, probably at this point. Uh, no. Oh my God, it's... It, stop! How many? Stop! <laughs> no, okay, we're in with the collections, Knights of Pen... No. no. Oh, the, the real New Warriors. Not the uh, new New Warriors? No, oh, the new, new no, no thanks. Yeah, I could be worth picking up. I pray to God the new New Warriors gets leaked. Yes, me too. Someone has Actually. to have it. So... Is this, this the second printing of it? New print. Oh, they had a, oh, no. this came out not too long ago. They're printing yeah. it again. 
Is that a new cover for it? Well, no. Or so, well, here's the thing. I had the Finch cover. This okay. was released at the stores, the comic book shops. Okay. So, yeah. I, mean, I might. I need to pick that up. Yeah. Yes, you should. Oh, an omnibus volume two coming out. Oh, and Alex Ross. Us. Yeah. So this is going to have the night. It's going to have the rest of the run from the original run, Iron Man, Power Man, Iron Fist. So a lot of the crossover stuff, Marvel fanfare, the mag, the, the magazine stuff. So cool. Yeah. I. Yeah. yeah. I'll get that too. Absolutely. I'll be there for that. Mm -hmm. It's going to be hot. I'm just waiting for uh, the um, for the next volume of the Honda's where it's going to have the 90s run in it. That's the one. Yeah, yeah that's going to be fun. That's the fun stuff. Mm -hmm. Get the Platt collection. Well, it's all good, but yeah, yeah Platt's awesome. Star Wars Legends. Yeah, John S. Rander. Uh, Okay. Yeah. If you like Star Wars. Yeah, if you like that stuff, sure. Go yeah, for cool. It. Young Avengers? No. Uh oh, ooh, Marvel Masterworks. Yes, here we go. Yeah, absolutely. Fall of the Mutants. Yeah, it's each other 219. Yeah. Yeah. Not Fall of the Mutants, I'm sorry. Mutant Massacre. Mutant yeah, Massacre, Mutant yep. Massacre. And Doctor Strange Collection. Nice. Not bad. Roger Stern. Paul Smith. Sold. R.I.P.D. Yeah. R.I.P.D. Doctor Strange. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag about time. Yep. <laughs> Uh, Incredible Hulk. Uh, yeah, maybe. Like Hulk. I, yeah. That, that old stuff's kind of... That's before Omnibus Volume 2. This is where it got weird. Uh, Captain America, Tony C. Coates. Nope. Oh, nope. Not Captain America. America. <laughs> no. 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 God damn. No. Star Wars is still a thing. Jesus, all these collections suck. Okay, maybe tour, maybe maybe, 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 maybe the tour one. Maybe the tour. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't sure. remember where that didn't happen. From the Ashes, that was a good story. From X Men, it was Paul Smith and uh, Chris Claremont. Yes. And Walt Simonson. Can't forget Walt. Poppy Walt. Walt. Yep. Ooh, Daredevil, Man Without Fear. That's... That looks like an interesting. Mm -hmm. um, Something. It's a good cover. Yeah, it's a good cover. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, Deadpool, the Circle Chase. Nice. So the early Deadpool stuff with before Fabian. He was awful. Yeah. Yes, before he was awful. Yes, <laughs> I, 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 yeah. well played. Yes. So that's going to have New Mutants 98, X Force 1, X Force 2, 11, and 15. Nice. No bad number four. Ooh, a lot of the early stuff. You know what? I'll probably pick that up. I actually I would not mind having that in my collection. Yeah. Yeah, I like to read some of that. Yeah. Conan the Barbarian. No. Stuff is, whew. yeah, that's when toward the end where it got poof, out there. Yeah. Definitely not. Oh, I'm Spider Man. No, no, no. Uh, Marvel Masterworks at volume two. That's gonna have issues 11 through 19 for 16 bucks. Yeah, maybe, maybe. maybe. Yeah. And all right, so Marvel, okay. that's Marvel for October. That's a uh, it's a big. Maybe it's good. You know, it's got some good stuff. Got some hokey stuff, but it doesn't look bad. I think, uh, hashtag it's about time. Yeah, hashtag it's about time. That, uh, sums up yeah. Marvel. So yeah, we'll get to that when we sum up. We just finished Marvel in 38 minutes. Holy crap! It's a new record time. We're going fast. Yes, we are. Fast and furious. <laughs> so here we go. We just finished Marvel. We're going to get over to Beat Street Comic Beats. Nope. Sorry, Comics Continuum for the DC Comics for October. So we got the covers right here. In the text, okay. so uh, if we want to zoom in, it's going to open a new window. We close it, so, which is okay. not bad. So first up, DC Comics, October. Yay. Batman the the Imposer, <laughs> Sorry, ah. Imposter. Oh, Imposter. This is written by the one of the screenwriters of the upcoming the Batman movie. Yeah, exactly. So Bruce Wayne's mission, and so this is like Bruce Wayne, I guess, and after relatively after a year one, he's been doing it for a while now. Year two. Yeah. Year three. One and a half. Okay. Bruce Wayne's mission as the Batman has only been underway for a year or so, but he can't, but he can tell he's making a difference. Unfortunately, he's made some powerful enemies. All the traditional power brokers of Gotham resent the disruption of Batman is brought to the town. Duh. And it seems one of them has, has a plan to neutralize them. There's a second Batman haunting Gotham's rooftops and alleys. And this one has no qualms about murdering criminals. Is he black? Uh, Probably, you know, probably. <laughs> is it the yeah. current Batman? <laughs> yeah, it's the current Batman, yeah. So, it just... It, is that the movie variant? It looks just it, pretty close to what... It's... All I know is like, this story like this is clearly written by someone who doesn't understand who Batman is. Um, is that Batman? Yeah, I guess they're kind of grounded. It's kind of being grounded in real world. Sure. Yeah, sure, yeah. 
a whole new, a whole new version of Gotham City is informed by grim reality. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. That so we got that going on. Yeah, yeah, Batman in the real world. It's never happened before. Yeah, far yeah. beyond. Who's reality? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, piss poor uh, screenwriter's reality. Yeah. yeah, what reality is. Yeah, but... Batman one fourteen. So we got that cover right there. That looks insane. Same. Yeah, I don't fear state. Yep. So Batman is racing against time to stop Gotham City from tearing itself apart. So the Scarecrow's long game is revealed. The Dark Knight has bigger problems, though, as an insane Peacekeeper one on a murderous rampage through the streets of Gotham. Can Peacemaker, Peacekeeper X stop him? It, I, the Future State did this story no help at all. It's like they're really merging Future State now to this when that's supposed to take five years in the future. <laughs> it's not helping. It's not. No, no it does not sound good at all. I mean, it just like my theory is sticking true that Batman went the main title Batman series just sucks. I, I don't like it at all. Uh, no point. Bueno. And Batman 115, Batman and Miracle Molly are all the stands between Gotham City and absolute insanity. So he's got one and a half help. Yay. And oh God. So, what? What is that? How is this tactical? How is this tactical in a fight? How I, is it anything? I, like, how's any of this? It, are you going to an X Men gala? Yeah, yeah, and it's a it's a it's a, it's a Batman gala. Yeah, yeah and it's a Batman dinner party. Yeah, they're all going to the Gotham gala. Yeah. Hey, God, no, Arkham I City. The oh, damn it, <laughs> the Order of the World number one. Texas uh, Arkham left them standing. What? I don't. That's stupid. what? It's a really uh, bad cover. All these covers are. Ter this looks like a Mortal Kombat cover. That's looks like Azrael. That is Azrael. That is Azrael. That has to be, right? Yeah. Azrael bear being a flipping story if you're going to tease Azrael. Uh, Azrael uh, dies. <laughs> yeah, he's has several <laughs> asylums. Patients escaped and scurried on the streets. Now these Arkham inmates walk among us. Up to, our, up to the asylum's one remaining doctor, Jocasta Joy, to round up her former... What? A black female in yeah. a three-piece suit, suit kills yes. Azrael. Yeah, probably. <laughs> so they got we got Azrael here on two covers. Yeah. Azrael better be in this flipping story. That is a, I love this wow. flipping cover. This cover like is beautiful. Cover. Yeah. It's damn beautiful. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Azrael better be in the story or I'm coming after them. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Yeah. Batman, Secret Jesus. Files, Peacekeeper. No, Didn't we already get his origin? Yeah, does anybody care about this it's, character? It's, anyway? it's, He's just a guy. Just a goon. Yeah. Hired goon. <laughs> Catwoman 36, Ram V. All right, you're still on it. Um, Gotham City Sirens reunion, no one saw it coming as Ivy senses Queen Ivy's presence. Oh, yeah, because Ivy split into two. I forgot about that. That's another okay. nice. Yeah. Um, here it becomes increasingly erratic. Catwoman decides that she is too vulnerable to keep an alley town and attempts to get her out of Gotham. Self and Riddler. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Maybe. Sure. See what happens. Right, Nightwing. I am done with Nightwing after his attack on uh, the the parents and making his dad into a poon hound. So. Well, of course. Yeah. Another carny <laughs> folk. Yeah. Yeah. And the terrorist organization known as the Red. Cr Another terrorist organization. What the hell? Wait. Don't. They have the mat. Never mind. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Took control of Mayor Nakano's personal security detail. Oh, the Batman can protect Gotham's highest. They're rushing to get the future state. They're, they're rushing trying. to get there. Yeah, they're trying. The Red Crown. That's such a dumb name. I am Batman number two. Nope. Once again, if you have to say you are Batman, <laughs> you are not Batman. Like, say in Game of Thrones, one who has to say he is king is not truly king. That second cover looks interesting. The uh, pose is... Yeah. <laughs> oh, never mind. I thought it was kind of something else. Oh, never mind. Yeah. It's him taking yep. off the cowl and I'm not Batman. Ooh, hopefully. Fuck Batman. Batman Urban Legends is number eight. Looks, yeah, so Chip Zdarsky is off the title, and I am officially off the series. Aww. Harley Quinn, no. No one cares. No. Riley Rossimo, definitely no. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Batman Fortnite one shot. I'll check that out. The series was not bad. It was not bad at all. It was good. Okay. I'll check it out. Scott Snyder's on the That's board good. now. And Greg Capullo cool. cover. Sure. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Batman Long Halloween Special. Absolutely. 
They buried late on these. These should be up in the, up at the front, especially yeah. Batman Long Halloween. I love this cover right That's here. That's cool. Oh, is that also by, by Tim Sale? Yes, it is. That's awesome. Yeah. We're seeing him at Terrificon. I'll tell him I'm looking forward to this. Yeah, that's what he says. The Catwoman Lonely City number one, Cliff Chang. Look, I know people love Cliff Chang's art. It's okay to me. I'm not looking forward to the city. It's like it's ten it's like ten years in the future. There's no villain, there's no um Commissioner Gordon, no villains, no Batman. So it's like so it's New York City. Literally. Yeah, yeah it's New York City. All right, congrats. Yeah. We built this city on all your dough. <laughs> DC versus vampires. This is the one I'm looking forward to. This one could be good. More vampires. It's in, this, it's in the vein of uh, deceased. So we got James Tynan and Matthew Rosenberg writing it. Other Schmidt okay. on the art. Okay. Um, very curious. Matina. Yeah, Matina. Yeah, Matina. That's that's clearly Matina. Oh. Yeah. It's a batpire. Yes, it is. It's a batpire. And got that. Uh, uh, art? Uh, no, don't no. not sure which which one from his school of learning is that is. Uh, um, okay, the Hal looks, yeah. Hal Jordan looks pretty cool. That is that Hal Jordan? That's Hal Jordan. Uh, cool. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. So the Justice League has long protected Earth from a all manner of foreign invaders. Yeah. Uh, from the years, keep vigilant in the skies for the next red. But what if throws already walk in the Earth? How do you plan to say it watching? Ooh. Mm. I will be there for this. One of 12? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I will be checking this out. I'll read the first issue. I mean, I really yeah. couldn't care less about vampires, <laughs> but yeah. we'll see. Yeah. If they do it right. Yeah, if, if Matt Rosenberg has a good editor, it'll be definitely yes. worth checking out, which I hope so. I hope so. <clears throat> And we got The Human Target written by Tom King. No. Yeah, so what I'm, I think what we, what we just, what we've, We'll be uh, theorized on the Thinking Critical podcast is that uh, the human target has hired someone to kill him because he can't kill himself. So it's going to end up out uh, 12 issues later of him. Uh, it's like yeah. Fletch? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Except, yeah. He's going to end up being a, a killed at the very end. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, by an assassin. Yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's also going to – oh, I forgot. He's also going to run uh, Justice League International through the mud, too, because they're going to be in the series, too. Well, so, thank God. Yeah. As well they should. Yeah. Okay. Hashtag it's about time. Yep. Hashtag time's up. Thank you, Tom King. <laughs> Thank you, Tom King. <laughs> Aquaman, Green Arrow, Deep Target number one. Oh. Ooh. The deep Target. Uh oh, that is not found. Oh, oh Death, no. Not found. Oh, no. Not, not found. Interesting. Oh, no. Okay. So, 80th anniversary of Aquaman, Green Arrow, Shaggy Organization known as Scor another Scorpio. Clever. <sighs> it's research. Re okay, that's an older. Okay, that's a that's a callback to an okay. older. Yeah. True. Um, okay. Mr. Scorpion. Yeah. <laughs> While looting the past for artifacts and treasure, they have somehow altered the timeline. Only Aquaman Green Lantern can fix it. Okay, I'll I'll check that out. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Batman Audio Adventure Special. Huh. What? What? Huh? What? Huh? huh? Ah, you hear the beautiful racket. It's music from Gotham City, the largest city in the world. The big Urgo, the treasure at night. He calls it a crime infested hellhole. Is dead wrong or not? Uh, no way hell has such great piorgies. Piorgies? Piorgies? Isn't that a Greek dish? I think piorgies is something like that. It's yeah. A, order a hot dish. dish yeah. A, so join okay. us here as we bring you stories behind the stories behind the hit HBO podcast from. No. I'm, you're you're, you're no. going way, way too long into this yes, crap. crap. No, <laughs> Wonder Woman 80th anniversary. Did we already do a 70th, 70, 70, 750? It's like almost every other month is an anniversary for these <sighs> fake anniversaries. Yeah, it's a fake anniversary. Yeah, and who they got working on it? They, okay, they've got one person, one person who legitimately deserves to be there, or two. Orlando. Mark Wade, kind of. Kind of. Mark Wade, Jose Luis Garcia Lopez. Tom King, Avi. <laughs> <sighs> it's like, you guys can get George Perez? I was who who redefined where? Wonder Woman in the 90s? So I was like, where's, where's he at? Where's, oh. Terry, where's, where's Terry Dotson? Oh. Dotson. 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 Got Dotson. Yeah. Um, where's no Adam Hughes? And more. It, it, <laughs> I've already tuned out. I've already checked out. 
and we're, and actually, where's uh, ba, 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 what's his name who was working on it? And uh, um, no, um, William Messner Lopes. Oh yeah. No, Mike Diodato. No, it's like none of the guys who redefined Wonder Woman. They didn't get the email. It's only the Flash and the Pants from the last five years working on it. Well, of course. That's Screw so that. This one, oh, Phil Jimenez. He was the one I was looking for. Yeah, who worked on it art wise, but he's working on this one, a new rewriting of history. For Wonder Woman, for the black for the black label by Kelly Sue De Kelly Sue DeConnick. Oh no! The, uh, if you don't like my policies, don't, don't buy my, my book. book. Don't read them. <laughs> <laughs> what comics are you reading? <laughs> uh, I will be there just for the Phil Jimenez art because his art is still on point. He did. He's doing the art for. Um, Oh, that's Ivan Reese. Never mind. Uh, Phil Jimenez, he's still a terrific artist. I will be, I'll be checking it out for the art, but I'm curious to see how bad they're gonna make the, the this new origin. Because hey, no one could do it better than George Perez. What he did. Hey, you gotta be on the right side of history. Yeah, and not gonna be on that side of Kelly Sudikonic. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Nubia and the Amazons. <sighs> Noob. All I had to see was Vidayala and Nubia, and I am <laughs> checked out. It's. <laughs> that is one way to set yourself up for failure right there. Man. Yeah. Nope. Ass. Wonder Woman. Jesus. Oh, all I got to say is if you're looking forward to Wonder Woman, you're going to have fun Dear with this. Lord. Lord. I'll say, okay, the only one I will read, the only one I will be reading is the special edition by uh, George, Greg Ruck and Liam Sharp. I like that, that's okay. when they did their the rebirth, the, uh, oh, uh, rebirth run. Yeah. Okay. That was fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. That was good. I'll read that. But I will say the one crime, the one crime of this anniversary for – Wonder Woman, they did not do one fucking special edition of George Perez's no. Wonder Woman run. None. That is a crime. That is a shame. If you've never read it, please go seek it out. It is fantastic. It is, in my opinion, the, the definitive Wonder Woman origin. Yeah, but um, that's what I know. No, the way I see this, they're pissing on his legacy and saying, "Nope, not you." Uh, down with the patriarchy. Yes, down with the patriarchy. Down with George Perez. No. Yep. Refrigerator full of heads. That sounds like a uh, James Tynan, <laughs> but it's yeah, not. Uh, I think it's <laughs> it's something. I don't. I don't know. Okay. DC Horror presents Soul Plumber. What? It sounds dumb. It sounds like word soup. Uh, that's really okay. Never mind. <laughs> What? That's, is that Riley Rossmo? If that's Riley Rossmo, I have checked out. And that is, he did a variant cover. That is his variant cover, apparently. Um, Was that, did, did a dolphin pick so, these titles? So, okay, podcasters wrote this one. Okay, that explains this. Okay, so, nope. Action Comics 1036. The War World Saga Begins. Now? It's now. now begin. Okay. Now. now. Now you can start so, reading it. Yes, now you can start reading it. Everything yes. else dog shit. That's a cool cover, him with the... Yeah. So, what? wait, huh? Okay, so the Superman, Superman and the Authority by Grant Morrison mm -hmm. is completely out of continuity. But in this continuity, he does have the Authority with him. Okay. I'm so confused. They all... Okay. Ah, Jesus. Why? Why did it make this so confusing? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, he's gonna try to liberate War World. We all know, and doesn't if you just it doesn't happen. He's in prison for the rest of his life, and he's yep. killed for yep. every time repeatedly. Yep, because down with the strong white males. Yep. Uh, Aquaman: The Becoming. Oh, oh, he's yeah, uh, he's coming. Okay, <laughs> so, he's, oh. so he's gonna come. He's okay. gonna come. Yep. Okay. He, yep. Moving on. Yep, there we go. Batman 89, number three. Here we go, finally. finally. We got... Ooh, evident... Uh-oh. Oh, wait, what? what? Oh, wait. What? What? Oh, I see the... The Batmobile? We got... Yeah. I see some old school sketches Chizik, back there. Gauntlet and number, the boots. Yeah. What is going on here? Oh, is this... Oh, is this Barbara? Is this... I think... Is that who they're introducing? Is that... I... Uh, as fire rages at Royal Auto, Harvey Dent lies trapped inside, unconscious and in danger. Ooh, mm -hmm. can Bruce Wayne get to Harvey in time? Or will the district attorney leave, leave burn? And more reason one. Yes. Oh. That is how you sell a comic. Yes. That is how you do it. Yes. Yeah. Oh, leave experience. Oh, I got to see this. Holy crap. 
Oh, oh Lee. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> yes. Love it. Fantastic, Lee. Both these covers are terrific. Yeah. I'm still there. I love it. I love it. Yeah. I love I'm, it. Yeah. The uh, fact that it's yeah. the it's the old school bat logo. It's the bat 89 yeah. bat logo. Yes. I I'm love there. it. I love yeah. What's not to love? So issue one, as of, as of this recording, the issue, the issue one, uh, part well, part one comes out digitally this week. That's right. So we can read it digitally this week, part one. Yeah. And I will be fair and honest in my review on it, if It'll, it's good or not. I'm yeah. going to put the member berry bowl yeah, to the know. side. And we, yeah. any anybody that's a fan of anything yeah. at this point has yeah. been burned. So. Yes. Yeah, yeah, but I'm trying not to because Sam Hamm is writing it. This is based off his script for issue for the upcoming yeah, movie. So movie, yeah. hopefully, <sighs> all right. Batman versus Bigby the Wolf, Wolf in Gotham City by number two, William Bill, Bill Willingham. Yes, sure. That's all you got to say. Bill That's Willingham, right. Batman versus Bigby. I am there. Uh, Batman Reptilian number five, issue two comes out this week. Can't wait to read it. Yeah. Oh, that cover. Oh. That is creepy. It really is. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and hopefully we do oh oh ooh, oh Frankavelli. Oh. Okay, Frankavella. That oh. is it a bigger killer crack? Oh. Uh we'll find out. And tomorrow rest. Yep. Batman Adventures Continue, season two, number five. I'll be there for this. I've loved it so far. That's uh true. except for this cover. <laughs> it's dumb. Yeah. Oh, the gray ghost. Right there in the hanging. Gray right there. ghost. One of my favorite yep. it, it, stories mm -hmm. in Batman lore. I love that. I love that episode. Here we go. Paul Denny, Don Burnett writing it. Yep. All right. Cool. Uh, old face returns to Gotham when former mayor Emerson Mayfield steps out of retirement. Oh, looking to once again rise to power. Ooh, Batman is thrilled with the mayor's homecoming, which was run-ins with him during the early years as the Cape Crusader. Ooh, could Batman deduce what Mayfield's plan for Gotham is before it's too late? Yes. I am there. I'm there for that. I'm there. Batman Catwoman number eight is only on issue eight. Holy crap! At this point wow. in October, it, it, this I love the cover. I love Clay Man. Clay yeah. Man, your talent is being wasted on this series, man. Yeah, absolutely wasted. It's a damn shame. Yeah, it is a shame. I feel so bad for Clay Man right now. Yep, he's just collecting yeah. a paycheck. But yeah, you yeah, know. you know, good for him. He's doing one yeah. book, but the story he's wasted on. Can you imagine if he was doing a Batman 89 cover? What that would look like? Oh, Jesus. I want to see Man. That. Black Manta number two. This cover is badass. That's cool. Yes. I don't care what it is, but I want to read it. Yes, absolutely. That's how you sell a cover. Yeah. Black Manta and Gallus pursue a deadly metal uh, coveted across the seven seas and all of the kills in Atlantean, DNA. Sure. Okay. Okay. If this happens in the book, that better happen in the book. All yeah. I got to say. Yeah. That better happen. Be half a panel. Yeah. Blue and gold number four. Absolutely. Okay. Blue and gold restoration. So cool. Love it. <laughs> that is so cool. Yes. I love it. Yes. Issue one was so much fun. Uh, Bros over heroes. No more. Booster Gold and Blue will find, find running a superhero business together more difficult than it looks. <laughs> yeah. Yep. End up on the verge of a breakup. Could cause uh -oh. such, such a schism. Uh-oh. Yeah. Uh-oh, indeed. Challenge of the Super Sons number seven. I'm there. Doesn't matter. Yep. Get rid of the Riley Rossimo cover. And yeah, I am there. Good. Check me number five. No. Crush and Lobo. Nope. DC Horror but Presents. It's crush. Nope. Deathstroke number two. Absolutely. That looks promising. Yes. Maybe. That God, his Deathstroke has always been awesome. It's perfect. Yes. Why is there always a woman towering over a man? Yeah, especially Black Canary. Yeah. Um, it's like, uh -huh, sure, I'll believe that. Deathstroke <laughs> in space. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ooh. Wow. Interesting. What the hell? This is. <laughs> has a whole lot of. God. Wow. Has a whole lot of crazy right there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it is. Deathstroke in space, secretization. Tr Another organization. How many organizations are there? My how God. Many secret organizations. Yeah, secret. Are and how do they not overlap with each Jesus other? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, design this new team and over the top mission heading to deep space. Okay, it is over the top. Okay. Heading to deep space and stop Cyborg Superman from spreading his consciousness to every machine in the multiverse. Okay. 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 You're bringing him back. Okay. Future State Gotham. Nope. 
Green Lantern number no. seven? Nope. No. Nope. Uh, Hardware season one number three? Depends on issue one. Yeah. Harley Quinn? Nope. No. I kind of rocket season four. Spoiler alert. I read issue one. Mm. I won't say what I thought. I may still be on board at this point with issue four. We'll see what happens. Oh. Uh, Justice League 69. <laughs> 69, dude. <laughs> uh, I'll be there for the Green, Land, for the Green Arrow stuff. Okay. Green Arrow and Black Canary, that's been damn good. Everything else has been terrible. Uh, mm. Justice League Infinity. Cover looks terrible. Uh, issue one was n a meh because they made Martian Manhunter hide out as an Indian woman, and it it, it boggles the mind. So okay, maybe in the uh, ooh Justice League number last ride number six. Oh, that's an awesome cover. That is wow terrifying. Holy hell, that is terrifying. That's a poster. Yes, it is. Damn. Justice League is stranded on Apocalypse. Deadlier than ever. Earth is in its crosshairs. Oh, the traitor in their midst. Bum, bum, bum. Ooh. I'll be there for that. Yes. Legends of the Dark Knigget, number six. Okay. Two Gotham City horror stories, horror stories. Horror. One following the possessed of Solomon Grundy, and the other story where Batman is forced to join forces with Killer Croc. Sure. <sighs> maybe. May yeah, maybe. maybe. Two for one. Hopefully one of them's good. Yeah. Mr. Miracle, no, not. not. Pennyworth, no. Robin number seven, yes, I'll still be on board with this. Okay. Nope, still doing the tournament, yep. Ruby Justice League, no. Can't. Scooby Doo, where are you? If you have kids, if you have a kid, they'll they'll enjoy this. That's all I gotta say. They're just too long. Yeah. 32 pages, it just seems yeah. too much. For, especially, yeah, for kids. Yeah, kids book. Yep. Shazam number four, no, absolutely not. Issue oh. one was complete character assassination of Billy Batson. And uh, so, no. Well, he yeah. is evil. Static, season one, birth of a villain. <laughs> um, guess you want to see him go down the path of being the villain. You'll enjoy this series. Give me a stack. Yeah. Uh, Suicide Squad number eight. I'll probably still be on board for this. It's been going up. Oh. It's a sleeper hit. That is something. It's cray cray. You got am oh, oh, ambush bug. Getting ambushed. Aha! <laughs> squad in hell. Hell and back. Duck in hell, the squad's only chance for survival is ambush bug. I'll, I'll check it okay. out. Yeah. King Shark, number two. Suicide Squad. Uh, yeah, maybe. maybe. Yeah, maybe. That's cool. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Absolutely. Who me in with that? Tim Seeley. Yeah, could be maybe. good. Yeah, maybe. could be. Could be. Yeah. Superman 78, number yeah, three. Nice. Here we go. Let's see these covers. Oh, he's looking at the crystals. We got, uh oh, his parents back? That cover sucks. Yeah, it's, yeah, not the, <laughs> yeah, this is not the best one. And we got. That's better. That's better. That still kind of sucks. Yeah. It doesn't look 78. Hey, no, it doesn't. No, that's the problem. None of them. Yeah. And this one, that Earth, that's Brian Hitch. It still looks dumb. They're not, they're not giving me the 78 vibe. No, it's, no, it's not. And that's, that's a shame. So in order to save him trouble, Superman must surrender to Brainiac or watch the city burn to the ground. Being taken aboard Brainiac's ship, Superman finds a shocking piece of his past that changes his entire future. Meanwhile, Lois Lane gets a cryptic message from a mysterious source claiming to have a way to save the Man of Steel. I'm on board for this. It's going to not be white anymore. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yep. We're back to 78. I'll check it out. I'll, yeah, I'll yeah. be reading it probably. Superman versus Lobo, number two. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, yeah. I like Lobo. Yep, I like Sheriff Lobo. So yeah, and he's actually Lobo. Yeah, he's, yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> not the new Fifty Two Lobo. Yeah. Yes. And Superman, Son of Kal El, number four. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the series. Yeah, new is the new. Yeah, Superman. Yes, the new. Yeah, maybe. Teen Titans Academy. No, I can't. That's too dumb. Batman Scooby Doo Mysteries. Like you said, there should be twenty some odd pages. Yeah. Coming out right, right before my birthday. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Flash seven seventy five. God, these covers are all awesome. They are terrific. Yeah, God, that's so cool. It's creepy. Yeah, yeah. it's creepy. So define it as creepy. <laughs> Hunt for the when a mysterious crash lands in the middle of Central City. Flash must race against time to stop. It's all it's ill effects. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. Joker number eight. Joker. Joker. That is a interesting cover. It's ma'am. 
Yes, it's ma'am. <laughs> it's pronounced ma'am. Now uh, we got here. But uh, oh, that, that's that's a Ryan Stoko. That is a Stoko cover. It is. A, that's. <laughs> what does that have to do with? What's to do with anything? I, it, Ryan, I love your art. I love it. But it's like, what the hell does this have to do with anything? <laughs> Like a Judge Dredd book or something. Yeah, yeah, it does. It really does. I'm like, I love it. Don't get me wrong. What does this have to do with Joker? If this doesn't happen in the book. Yeah, I want this in the book now. It's like, this better be in the damn book. It's like a fever dream. Like, yeah. what is this? Wow. Uh, that's awesome. I'm sorry, James Stoko, not Ryan Stoko. James Stoko. Sorry. James Stoko. Jim Gordon was warned uh, to head back to the light while he still can, but his guest to apprehend the Joker is taking him deeper into the darkness. Taking him deep. Deep, deep. Joker actually be innocent of the attack in the Knockham Asylum. Okay. Yeah. Punchline back. Uh, yep. Queen Slay. Yeah. Uh, Joker presents puzzle box number three. Maybe is Matt Rosenberg. It's a big oh, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, um, it's, nice it's house in the lake. No, I jumped off after issue two. It's nothing new. Like I said, if you've read Twilight Zone, if so, okay. If you've watched the Twilight Zone, you've watched Outer Limits, you've watched the uh, Night Gallery, mm. uh, Ray Bradbury theater yeah. monsters. Um, tell us from the dark side. Are this is nothing new. To you. Are you afraid of the dark? <laughs> tell us from the crypt. This is nothing new to you. I'm sorry. It's nothing new. I mean, yeah. it, it's if you're not familiar with that stuff, I can understand why your mind would be blown. Like how James T James Tynan is, is the Queen Slay. This is this is amazing. It, it's it's okay. I mean, it's nothing new. Hey, yeah. When you ape the best. Yeah. Is that, it's, uh, hey. <laughs> Swamp Thing number eight. They buried this at the bottom. Holy crap. Wow. That cover is... Interesting. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Hidden right there. I love it. That is damn good. Yeah. yeah. I like that. Very clever. Uh, let's see here. It's working out for you, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Terrifying reunion. When Levi, Levi making his choice. The new avatar, the green, draws one step closer to escaping the clutches of the Suicide Squad. Was it already too late? That. Yeah. As the squad bolster themselves to an unstoppable end. Ooh, oh. yes. I am there for that. Yeah. Titans United. Guest starring Hawk and Dove. Yeah, that changes that changes things. I'll probably be there for that for mm -hmm. Hawk and Dove. Yeah. I'll, I'll probably check this out. Because okay. it's the actual, uh, yeah, Teen Titans in this book. Yeah. Not uh, yeah. whatever. Not the, whatever the rag thing. thing. <sighs> yeah, not the rag thing. Yeah. Oh, uh, Wonder Girl. <sighs> Oh, Joel Jones is officially off the, as artist now at this point. Oh, she didn't even make it five issues. Holy crap! And Adriana Mello didn't even make it one issue after one issue. Holy crap! That is. Are they giving everybody a chance? Wow! Apparently, they give Pete a chance. Yeah. So it's like I really want to try to like Wonder Girl, but it's like yeah. they're making me hate it. Yeah. I don't know why, because I really want to like it. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. Uh, we'll see after issue three. Or four at this point. Issue yeah. two was delayed for two months. So we'll see what happens with this. All the good ones are. Yeah. <laughs> After the events of Death Metal, Diana finally makes it back from the Unforgettable Odyssey through the Sphere of the Gods. Yay. Has a role moved on without her. So Diana's finally back to the land of the living. Doesn't matter. No. Nope. You've uh, been replaced. Yeah. <laughs> like by multiple Wonder Woman. Yeah. yeah. She's going to retire. Be like, yeah. I'm done. You guys are better. You, you all are better. <laughs> yes. Uh, let's see here. Wonder Woman Black and Gold. Maybe. Are they still doing that? Still doing it. Wow. Ugh. Uh, Batman. Okay, we're into the collections uh, now. Okay, good. Our detective. No. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Long Halloween Dark Victory Deluxe Edition. Ooh, collecting them both. Okay. Four hundred and sixteen pages. Yeah, it's collecting them both, man. Ooh. Yeah, it's twenty-four issues right there. I think. Yeah. Only Including bucks. Yeah, if it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so here, Batman Teenage Mutant Turtles Omnibus. Ooh, interesting. What's this? Oh, a Kevin Eastman cover for the Omnibus? Wow. Fascinating. But them actually trying, too. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> Catwoman Volume 5, Value of Shadow of the Death, maybe. Is that a oh, kid's book? No. Oh. Uh, Justice League Endless Winter? No. Oh. Suicide Squad Volume 1, Give Peace a Chance? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, there's one or two issues there where it kind of yeah. dipped, but yeah, maybe. Superman the Authority depends on the next uh, three issues. <laughs> Pointless. 
issue one, I, I issue one was just flipping weird. We need discovery. It was written back in 2018. Yeah. My God. Oh yeah. Uh, Superman, the one who fell. No. Uh, 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 Superman, Batman, Omnibus Volume Two, the OG Superman, Batman. Uh, oh, so yes, maybe. maybe. Teen Titans Go. No. Go to hell. No. Dreaming. No. Green Lantern Season Two. No. Oh. Something Volume One. Yes, absolutely. Truth yes. and Justice. No. <laughs> Wonder Woman, Silver Age, Omnibus. Yeah, if you're into it, yeah, sure. Yeah. So this is DC. Wow. Uh, huh. Hmm. Damn, I don't know if they're better than Marvel, to be honest with you. I really yeah, don't know. I don't, yeah, I don't know either. Um, but we'll finish up. We're going to finish up strong with Image. Here we go. Oh. Hour 10. This has been the fastest okay. one yet. Here we go. Good. All right. October. Friday, book one, the first Friday, first day of Christmas. Ed Brubaker. No. <laughs> that, I don't know. I, I don't know. Uh, for the first time, a young adult detective, Fear finally grows. What is your what? Red paperback. Twin Slot and Crimes digging up occult secrets with her best friend, Twin Slot Jones. Twin uh, Jones. Uh, I, I'm fine. Nothing. No thanks. Gunslinger Spawn 1. Yes. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Brett Booth, Philip Tan as an artist. Uh, yes. Yes, that's how you do it. Todd, top other writing with Alice Cott. Oh. Uh oh. And we got a lazy Todd cover. cover yes. Yeah. Uh, well, I think this is the Brett Booth cover right here. I think that's Brett. Yep, it's Bruce yeah. McFarlane on, on that one, definitely. Yeah. Oh, we'll, we'll get back to that. <laughs> uh, I, yeah. uh, I am completely sold on this until I saw Alice Cott's name. I. It's like this book contains uh, three separate gunslinger stories. Fascinating. So it's history it tours through time. Okay. Okay. Two yeah, but you got these guys doing the art. A good artist goes a long way. Indeed. Also, I might say, especially on Spawn. Yeah, I want to see a shootout. There better be a flipping shootout in this. He's a gunslinger. Yes. He better be shooting somebody. Yeah. If he's not shooting someone in this, I will be pissed. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. That's what I came here for. So yes, we are there for that. Hellcop number. Is it Helicop? <laughs> like helicopter. What the fuck? That's Stephen Hawking. S Stephen Hawking the helicopter. <laughs> helicop. It's hello. like a bad. It's like a yeah. Hello. <laughs> hello. It sounds like a bad eighties cartoon. It does. <laughs> Mankind first broke through the walls between dimensions. Nothing could have prepared them for what they would find. In known reality, playing thirteen oh one, absolute hell, literally. <laughs> I, of course, if you can't sell it with helicop, you gotta sell it with spawn on the oh, cover. Okay. Yeah, of course. We're just gonna see what the spawn. And like. they're already doing a Halloween special. Oh. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, this is terrible. This is this is just, this is laughably bad. Will image yeah. print anything? Yes, they will. At this that point, they like will. It. Yeah. Yikes. Uh, the Magic Order Two, number one. Oh, Magic Order are back. That was a fun first run. That was a fun first series a few years ago. Uh, so I'll be, read it, yeah. yeah, it was fun. So I'll gladly be checking this one out. Oh, Mark, Mark Miller's Mark. back. Stuart Eminem doing the art. Sure, okay. absolutely. Need a ha Need a Hawes nightmare blog. Need a Hawes. That is. That's creepy. Yep, disgusting. That dumb. That's something. Looks like a Cthulhu. So I guess it's an so nightmare blog out of her phone. So, huh. Uh, Oh, from the writer Philadelphia. Oh, oh, oh I see where they're going go. with this. Yeah. yeah, this will be another sleeper hit. Go ahead and pick this one up. So, Lurk, in Baltimore. So, oh, I guess it was across. It crosses over with Philadelphia. Philadelphia. Yeah. yeah. So. And Candyman. Yep. So I gotta say is, deuces, jug on. Yeah. Pick this one up, guys. That'll yeah. be on Netflix pretty yeah. soon. Righteous Thirst for Vengeance, and I'm assuming Man Stone was on a dark, dark web contract assassins. To kill this and target turns itself into one. Into one. Professional one. meets real perverted perdition. A story of families unlikely guarding, guarding being hunted. Uh, maybe, maybe I, I, I don't know. Okay. Maybe, but definitely, it's definitely maybe after reading Rick, about Rick Remender lately, how he's been a complete douche not yeah. giving up his royalties to artists. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> maybe. Donkey Dog World. Yes, it is. 
Two moons. Now a series has been very boring. Snore. Yes. I feel like uh, if you like uh, Claremont level types of dialogue where it just goes on and on, then uh, yeah, you do not. Yeah. Walking Dead. No. <laughs> Who who was the one person still reading? That I don't. They're, they're buying it for the covers. They are buying it That's for the is. covers. God. Comp. This is a guy to comic book lettering. Nope. Okay. Fine print volume one. I. <laughs> Not mother. Yes, no. hardcover. Jesus Christ. Twenty five bucks. Okay, so we're already in the tra we're already in the trades. trades? Holy oh, crap! No. That was quick. For time, no. They cancel like 15 titles from Image? So it looks like, one? holy crap, almost all their titles are canceled. <laughs> Cinder, t Trade, Farm, Trade. No. Wow. N none of these. I'm, none of these. Nine. Not nine. Ant. No. Ant okay, now we're, back to, now we're back, okay. back to actual comics. Okay. Here we go. Uh, Compass. I didn't, know there, I didn't, didn't even know there was a Compass number one. That, okay. <laughs> Meanwhile, part four, Christopher. Yeah. Reasons. If you like that Maybe. stuff, sure. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Deep Beyond? No, definitely no. Oh. Echo Lands? I don't know. No. No? Firepower? No, I never read it. Don't care. Good Asian? No. Frontiersman? The no. good, crazy, rich Asian? Yeah, it, 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 kids comics. Now you want to talk about just want to put a bullet in your head. This is the Aww. comic. Uh, homesick pilots. No, terrible. Ice cream man twenty seven. Oh, here we go. Hey. Yeah, here we go. This is like that famous story, but the other way around. Like cop. So it's Kafka's uh, metamorphosis. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Good. Okay. There's a twist. All right. Yeah. A twist. I like that. Jupiter's Legacy Requiem. Issue two was all right. Issue two wasn't bad. I'll probably check this one out. Okay. No on Philadelphia. King Spawn number three. I don't know. Sure. Yeah, sure. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. I'll, 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 yeah. I'll give it. I'll check I'll, it out. I'll yeah, because it it's Spawn. Yeah. Yep. Uh, Made in Korea. No. Man Eaters the Cursed. No. no. The Me You Love in the Dark number three. Scotty Young. No. I guess he was Scotty Young. Scotty Young. He's the man. Bloody and Song. I thought that was done. I could have sworn it was done. done. Ordinary Gods number four. Maybe. I read issue one. Issue one was intriguing enough to keep me going. We'll see how okay. issue two goes. Primordial. Yes, because this sounded mind-bending, this story. By it's Jeff, Jeff Lemire. Lemire. Yeah. Nazi, Nazi hunter, Jeff Lemire. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, um, yeah. I, I'll be checking this out. Radio Black number nine. Uh, Hopefully, if it gets past the Power Rangers aspect, yeah. second chances. I didn't even know there's an issue one, so maybe it depends on issue, how good issue one is. Sure. Uh, six side kicks of Trigger Keaton. No. Ish, yeah. Ooh, Spawn 323. Yes. I don't know what that is, but yep. Absolutely. Yep. I don't know what it means, but I think I like it. Yep. Uh, Stillwater. Never read it. No. Fame Mercy. Movie? Is there a movie coming out called Stillwater? Is there? With uh what's his name? It's Matt Damon. Hmm. St. Mercy. No. Mirka Sweet Paprika. You guess starring Joseph Garnish. That's yeah. right. Joseph Garnish is now in Sweet Paprika. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> that Texas Blood. No. Time before time. Maybe. Depends if it's yeah, still. Yeah. That, yeah. Trover saves the universe. I, I'll see. See that? Oh, that Justin Roiland. No, I see. Was a Justin Roiland's name. I am staring clear of that. Uh, Undiscovered Country Seventeen. Charles Souls cut Snyder. I forgot it was even up to issue yeah, ten. I know. <laughs> Vinyl number five of six. Finally, something with an end. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, uh, wow. Nice. So all I gotta say is, so Kyle. Yeah. In summary, I'm gonna say October is a very strange month. It is. Uh, all three leave me very unsettled. Very. I'm not. I'm not sold on any of them, to be honest with you. Yeah. Neither am I. Same here. None. None of the. None of these three leave me comfortable. No, I'm worried. 
Yes. About all of them come October. Yeah. Hopefully, uh, Sean will be around to where I don't have to do any top tens because uh, it's going to be rough. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to get a little rough. Yeah. Um, that sucks. It's my birthday month. Yeah, I know, right? And uh, October is always a fun time of year. This is when mm -hmm. you get the creepy stories of Halloween mm -hmm. and all that stuff. It's like, yeah, but this stuff, it's yikes. I don't I, I guess I'm more excited for Marvel. <laughs> I mean, I honestly don't know. I mean, they're all just, there's some duds. Yeah, there are. Uh, so like you, I would say, to me, Marvel has the best chance of coming out as the victor for the month of October. Yeah, Venom could be good. You yeah, Spider-Man could be good. Chain, Amazing Fantasy should be good. Should still be, yeah, should be still be going strong. You got the uh, Dark Age. Hopefully that's yeah, still Dark going Ages. strong. Um. That you have the death of Doctor Strange going on. Yep. X Factor. Maybe. Uh, oh, you got the Inferno number yeah. two. Yeah. The Joe Jesco covers helping it out. Oh, big time. Having all, all the series. And you got Moon Knight still going. Um, yeah. So I would say Marvel has the best chance right now of coming out as a victor. I agree. Yeah. Then DC and then Image. Yes. <laughs> So um, that wraps up our uh, solicitation review for October. It's a very uh, interesting month, to say the least. Yes. Um, so like we said, Marvel probably has the best chance coming out of the victory, but we'll see what happens. Yep. So um, in closing, guys, I want to say thank you for tuning in. We appreciate it. We've crossed over 4,100 subs in a week of the 4,100. We truly appreciate it. Thank you. And uh, so Kyle, as, as you guys are watching this, Kyle will be sticking with me this week because uh, Sean is on the lamb right now. It's, it's bad. not. It's bad. It's not looking good. Yeah. yeah. It's like the beginning of From Dust Till Dawn. Dawn. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Man, yeah, it's scary. Um, but um, and then we got Turficon coming up this weekend. So um, it won't be a video this weekend coming from us because we'll be at the show. So hopefully you guys will be tuning into our live sales of Turficon. And um, a lot of SIGs. Yeah, a lot of SIGs. There will be a lot of SIGs. You want signed books. Trust me. Yeah. Yeah. Tune in to us. We're going to have a lot of options. Yep. A lot of options. Um, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell. Please. It's down there somewhere, usually. Uh, what are you looking forward to the most in October? Please let us know. So, once again, for Comic Sleep, I am Drew. Kyle. And you guys.